Okay, we just want to thank everybody for being here. It was it was great to see the support in the building, and obviously a special night. And uh, our guys really enjoyed the the support. I thought that was the best hockey game that we've played all year, and against a very highly touted opponent, I think it showed our guys a lot of of. Uh, how good we're growing and how we're where we're going, but they're a good hockey team, and we made you know one or two plays that we probably like back, and they scored, and that's the difference in the game. So really proud of the guys, really proud of the way they competed, really impressed, and they continue to be impressive in their intent. Coach, uh, one minute in, no goal call. Your your thoughts on that call? You guys that made the difference in the end. Yeah, I disagree with it, but I disagreed with a lot tonight. So what else do you disagree? With? I'm gonna. Keep that to myself. Fair enough. Um, Chris has been uh, out of the lineup in and out, injury and not injury related for him to get that goal tonight. Uh, good sign for him. Yeah, no, it's uh, you know it's a competitive atmosphere and, and environment and culture, and we're excited for him to to get that, and <clears throat> hopefully that gives him some confidence and get some rolling. You guys are uh, like a quarter of the way in now, and. Uh, I mean, after tonight, obviously you're not jumping for joy, but it, looking at the big picture, are you happy with where you guys are? You know, you've had some injuries and stuff like that. And again, you're about a quarter of the way through. What do you like about your team? And what do you think maybe you got some work to do on? Yeah, we're, we're ecstatic. Like I said, I, I thought tonight was a really good effort. We haven't played one game yet with what we think is kind of our full lineup. So that's exciting. We still have some key pieces that haven't had the chance to play for various different reasons. And uh, the intent of the guys and where they want to go has been so, so good and so impressive. I think they learned a lesson tonight about uh, college hockey's good. And we can play a really good game, and, and you, you don't always come out on the right right ends of things. But uh, most importantly, I think what the guys learned is the process over the product. And now we just need to keep going with that process and do it do it again tomorrow night. Have a short memory and be ready to play. Coach, uh, after they scored their first one, um, Wilson made a couple good saves. One on a quick break with his toe. Um, the other one escaped and put a rope down. So it'll go in the story. Don't worry. Um, but his ability to just bounce back from, from giving up that first goal because it's probably a rebound he, he'd want back, but he responded well. Well, he's been so calm and so poised, and, and as I've said before, his craft, he continues to grow, grow in his craft and gives our guys a lot of confidence, and it's nice to know. Uh, back there that if, if you do make a mistake or play doesn't go where you want it to go, that uh, he's going to be back there and he's got you. So. Yeah, Brian's been uh, pretty good for you guys so far this year. Yeah. And uh, it, nice to, to rely on someone back there, you know, somebody solid uh, in goal. And just to, if you could comment on that, that'd be great. He seems like he's been pretty good. He's been outstanding. He, he's he's really grown since the first game he played at, at Colgate, and uh, he's a very much a student of the game, and works really hard, not only in practice but with the video. and And he's always got ideas, and he thinks about it, and he knows situational awareness. I think is really impressive when to play it, when to hold it, when to freeze it, uh, when to move it. He's just he's been really impressive. Does great in school. He's a really good person. He's he's one of the guys that as we continue to grow here that we want to put up on a pedestal and that's what a purple eagle looks like. Tough that uh, Derry didn't get that power play chance in and that was a hell of a save. Yeah, great, great save by them, and you know, as well as we played, they deserve a lot of credit too, right? They, they had, a, they played real well and, and played a patient game and took advantage of some of the opportunities. And you know, obviously, we keep getting Darian pucks like that, and he keeps earning pucks like that. A lot of those are going to go in. So that's that's hockey, and and their guy made a great save on it. Coach, you guys, um, in the end, uh, I mean. If you could go through the thought process, just uh, I know you like to play an aggressive style. Three minutes left, you pulled the goalie. They got one with uh, over a minute left. That being or just I mean, I don't want to say there are any regrets because I know you like to play offensively, but just what goes into that decision to pull them so, so early? Yeah, no regrets. We do life here, right? It's it's about attacking and going. We had a lot of good chances, I thought. Uh, good looks at the net, and I believe Patrick Waugh started this a couple years ago. Why not? What's Let's go. And I thought we had a lot of good looks. The guys know what we're doing in 65. And uh, we had some chances. And they blocked one shot that, that 
there's a good chance that might have gone in. So we're, we're going for it, and, and we want people that want to be here and want to play and, and attack.